Simply learn. Your pace, your place. Financial Risk Manager (FRM). Part one of the FRM exam covers the fundamental tools and techniques used in risk management and the theories that underlie their use. Trading strategies involving options. Welcome to the thirty-second session in your preparation for FRM Part One exam. In the previous session, we have learned the properties of stock options, their upper and lower bounds, and their values at expiration. Options give us the flexibility to have different kinds of payoffs under different market scenarios. We can use options to trade strategically and to devise our own payoffs. In this session, we will learn how to combine different options and create some interesting payoffs. These strategies can be customized to suit different market expectations. Let us begin this interesting session. Agenda: The main agenda of this session will be to learn how to combine options with stocks, or how to combine two or three different options to devise a trading strategy. We will learn some popular trading strategies, such as covered calls and protective puts, that combine options with stocks. We will then learn about spread strategies, in which we buy or sell options at different strike prices or expiry prices to create the desired payoff. Finally, we will learn about some combination strategies that combine two or more strategies, such as a straddle, strangle, strips, and straps. Covered calls and protective puts. Let us analyze the payoff from a covered call strategy. In this strategy, we long a stock and short a call at the same time, which reduces our initial outlay. If the price decreases, the call expires as worthless, and some of the loss from the stock is compensated by the gain from the call premium. When the price rises, the increase in price of the stock is equal to the loss from call, and payoff is constant. In case of protective put. We purchase a put along with the stock. When the price of the stock decreases, it is compensated by the gain from the put, and loss is limited to a constant amount. When the price increases, the put expires as worthless, and there is a gain from the stock, which becomes positive after sufficient movement to cover up the initial outlay in buying the put. Spreads, bull bear spread. In a spread strategy, we purchase 